Beginning in shot. Yep, I'm doing it. I found the Pfizer, it's the one I wanted, so. Can you get to see this? But I swear to God, it's gonna happen. Okay, hey, we both got our first shot. We got the Pfizer shot. We're staying here for a few minutes, you know, because I know this from giving shots to the livestock. Any shot, not just the any shot, any shot can cause a reaction. So they just want to make sure that you know, with the 20 million thousand people that are getting these shots, that you know. For a few minutes, you don't just rush out and get in your car and then you know you're on your way home and all of a sudden you have a dizzy spell or something like that. You know, just sit down and chillax for a minute. Uh, we are coming back in 21 days for our next shot, right, Jake? Jake has a shot phobia because, as most of you know, when he was small, he went through some trauma. That was traumatized. And ooh, did he get a lot of shots? So, what did you think, Jake? How bad was it? I didn't feel. Uh, you know, let me tell you what now, he is paranoid of shots. So if he thought it was no big deal, that's no big deal. So guys, you know, we're gonna sit here for a few minutes. I'll get back to you in a minute and let you know how you know we're okay. And yeah. First of the Pfizer. Yeah. Jake, say bye-bye. Go gators. Go gators. Pizza, pizza. Hey, so we got our shots. We're doing good. Like, like nothing. Jake, pull up my sleeve so you can see the Band-Aid. Band-Aid. So, yeah, nothing. How about you just pull up your sleeve? Yep. So it's like way... I am now way immune to everything. I'm immune Where? to everything. Where is it? <laughs> there it is. Yeah, Jake. Jake is, he's like, I'm super Jake. Go ahead, tell him, Jake. Go get to her. everything! <laughs> Alright, so Jake's going across the street. We're just taking a little break so we can get a soda and basically Yeah, I'm feeling good. Now we gotta go back in 21 days and get our booster shot. And here was a like a plus was I got it done at, at a grocery store pharmacy because that was the one that had the Pfizer. I didn't want Johnson and Johnson. They've been kind of, you know, they've been kind of not right lately. So yeah, I, I, my trust is not with them. And the Moderna, I never heard of them people before. I got no opinion. I never heard of them people before. I wanted the Pfizer, okay? Every place I asked, and I did. I got to the point where I was like, you know, I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go in and ask, you know. Well, you need to make an appointment. Do you have, you know, which one do you have? Oh, we have Moderna. Yeah, well, no. Nope, 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 nope. So I was expecting, you know, could we walk in there and I, you know, go over to the pharmacy and I said, you know, hey, um, I have a couple of questions. Number one, um, you know, obviously you have the COVID shot, you know, which one do you have? You know, oh, we have Moderna. I said, yeah, I know. So you wouldn't happen at being a, a pharmacist, you wouldn't happen to know who has the Pfizer. He says, no, we have Pfizer too. I was like, what? I said, okay, so I don't have insurance. So if I have no insurance, how much is this shot? And obviously, you know, it's free. So I was like, okay, cool. So, so I see that you need an appointment because it says, you know, on the board, you must have an appointment, blah, blah, blah fucking blah blah dot com blah 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 you know you gotta do all this shit online right and he says you know what I, 
not, there's no one here. I'm not filling any prescriptions right now. If you have a few minutes, we can do this right now. I said, yo, dude, let's do it. So Jake was doing a little shopping. Jake walked over. He got his done too. We go back in 21 days. Both of us, no reaction. Like I could feel it, but I wouldn't call it pain. It was just like, like I could feel it a little bit for about the first maybe 90 seconds, like a minute and a half. And now it's like, no, nothing, nothing. And Jake, he has a phobia about needles because y'all know he, you know, had brain surgery as a child. And trust me, that boy had a lot of, a lot of poking done on him in the hospital. And he, he truly does have a phobia, you know, so he just looked at me. I said, dude, look at me. Look at, look at your mama. We be talking, we was talking about Jessica and some music. Of, you know, our friend just Jessica and some music. And then he looks down and I said, Jake, it's too late, it's already done. He's like, oh, I didn't even feel that. I, said, I told you. I told you. So yeah, it's you don't feel it. Just don't look. Don't look and it won't hurt. Don't look. The, the anticipation is worse than the actual shot. And I'm, you know, I'm kind of relieved. I'm familiar with Pfizer. I've had livestock, horses, goats, you know, dogs, what I have. I've had all kinds of critters all my life. And most of the time I've done my own shots because veterinaries are not cheap okay they, they not only charge you for the shot they charge you to give the shot and they charge you for like the shit that's you know like the, the needle and the syringe that you know to give the shot so like yeah um we're like for the goats i can go to tractor supply store i can pick up a vial of 10 freaking shots for eight dollars the needles cost about 25 cents a piece and the syringes cost like 30 cents a piece. I mean, seriously, nowhere near. And then the vet, the vet charges you to come out. So it's like $50 before you even open the door, you know, there's that call fee. So yeah, and I've always, I've always had Fort Dodge and Pfizer. So I'm familiar with Pfizer. I've given a million vaccines to my animals made by Pfizer. They've, you know, I've never had anybody have a bad reaction. You know, once in a while somebody has a reaction, but usually it's because they were stupid and they tensed up or they, you know, bent their head and bent the needle or, you know, did something stupid. It had nothing to do with the actual shot. But, you know, and then there's that whole thing with... Anybody can have a reaction to a shot. It doesn't even matter what the shot is. You can have a reaction, like a severe reaction, to the act of getting a shot. It, it doesn't even, like what's in the shot doesn't even make any difference. It's, it's like the action of getting the shot has something coming into your body and your body goes, fuck you, I'm shutting down. So. You know, you always, whenever you get a shot, you want to take a minute, make sure that you're not going to have like a dizzy spell or, you know, you know, sometimes, sometimes shit happens. Just take 15 minutes out of your day to not be dead, you know, got no time to be dead. It's not an option. So y'all take care of yourselves. Um, getting the, the shot, and I call it a shot because, you know, if you can still catch the disease, in my opinion, it's not a vaccine. But this is a personal choice. If you don't want to get that shot, do not get that shot. However, you're not going to get that shot. Even if you do get the shot, mask up, baby, and do your six feet. You know, I'll tell you what, even when I'm in the store, and I have a mask on, someone that I don't know comes anywhere near me, I turn my head the other direction, and I ain't trying to be rude to nobody, I ain't trying to be rude to nobody, but 
I just want to make sure that what I'm breathing in is not coming off of nobody else. I'm, I'm sorry, I got no time to be dead. I got no time to be dead. Y'all stay safe. I love you so much. And I'm, I'm feeling some relief. <clears throat> I'm feeling some relief. I have a naturally high titer. And I've already had this thing like a couple years ago. So I feel like, I, you know, my tiger to it is already pretty good. And I feel like with the social distancing, the fact that I live very secluded and, you know, I wear a mask a lot of the time, a lot of the time. I mean, I, I try really hard to keep it. I mean, sometimes, Sometimes you just, you gotta pull it off your nose for a minute so you can catch some fresh air, but you know, I try real hard to keep it up whenever there's anyone within six feet of me. And um, you know, and now I got the shot too, so I'm feeling pretty protected. I'm feeling like, you know, I'm, I'm feeling like, you know, if I was to get it, it would be like, a, you know, a regular flu type of thing. Definitely would not kill me or end up in the hospital, which I ain't ended up in the hospital. I got no insurance. So you just kill me and get it over with because, yeah, I'd be homeless anyways. So, guys, do what you got to do. Do your research. Decide, you know, between the shots because they're not all equal. So... Don't do research on one and then not the other. Do it on all of them. And until next time, I hope you wake up dancing, ba -bum -bum, wake up dancing, ba -bum, dancing and a prancing every single day. <laughs> bye bye. Woo, okay, we're home. Um, I'm looking a hot mess, but I did want to. Um, wanted to give you your clue your clue so go back to the video a gift from glam goat some lucky subscriber follow the directions there but besides that your clue in here is well w-e-l-l -L, and you need to use that in a sentence down below in the comment you can say i hope you are well you can be talking about the kind of well you get water out of be anything, just well. Well is the word. Oh well. Okay. So um, you know, thumbs up. Drop me a comment with the word well. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure you subscribe. Watch the video all the way through and go back to a gift from Glam Goat to a lucky subscriber. Follow your directions in there because you have to find your original comment in that video. So if you haven't done that, watch the video and follow the instructions. You know, go in and comment or find the comment you already have. Reply to that comment. You don't really have to make a sentence over there. It'd be great if you did, but you don't have to. Just take your word well, you know, icon or emoji or just the word and make a reply to your original comment and you'll get an extra entry. Also, um, I don't have them with me, but I'm gonna throw in a set of brushes from Wet n Wild. Um, they're in a box. I'll sell them to you in the box, but I'm gonna have to take them out of the box to send because I don't have a box big enough to ship put the whole box of brushes in <laughs> I know right like what but yeah there's that anyway so guys good luck and you know on with the video